Welcome back everyone, Final Fantasy XIV. Here in Oldar, steps of Thrall. Thali. Ooh, somebody's airship. We're here at the Guildmaster for the Alchemy Guild. Working on the level 45 quest. Ultimate Alchemy. Guildmaster's servant appears in frantic need of your assistance. So if the same thing with this. We'll just take... We got one of each of these, so... We'll just take another one. But we'll get 400,000 XP. Nice. An Electrum Alchemic. So let's go ahead and start this thing. This is B. Beyond comprehension. My experiments were conclusive, and yet there remains some fatal flaw in the process. Where does the fault lie? The method, the materials, my inter interpretation of the results? Must I resort to thermology after all? No. Such energies will raise naught but a mockery of life. Ah, what an utter failure. I must retrace my steps, start again from the beginning. No matter how many times it takes, I will see my alchemy succeed. You, assistant, bring me three mega potions. One each of intelligence, mind, and vitality, and they must be of unquestionable quality. I care not for excuses. I need I need you too. Please, my friend, I need your help. Well, just so happens. Oh, tell him you need cold. I have three extra on hand just for you. The mega potions. Dear assistance, please. Intelligence, mind, vitality. And do not think to fool me with some batch of mediocre marbles. That's for you. That's for you. And that's for you. So, temper increases intelligence by 61 max. 61 and 62 vitality. Yes, yes. These are suitably superb. As ever, your work is swift, precise, and uncommonly brilliant. Black scorpion to sharpen one's wits. A ram membrane for the mind. Boil your grenade ash to fuel vitality. All unnecessary components in the alchemical process. I attempted earlier the self-same one that ended so abominably. On that matter, I offer my apologies. I was so unwaveringly confident of success that my failure that my failure put me in a frenzy to gather a new batch of regents post haste. And to manage such a feat quickly meant I could not do it alone. I was able, however, to prepare another incomparable mega potion of strength while you were at work on these potions at these potions sure properly combine these four the primary attribute strength vitality intelligence and mind can affect mortal resurrection and now my dear assistants you understand why i hope to achieve with this highest of alchemy does this revolution shock you did you think the dead beyond our reach? That is certainly the common perception, and even I am forced to acknowledge the seemingly insanity of my actions. But I believe in alchemy's unlimited potential. It was the cause, it was the cause of my regrets, and it shall be the source of my salvation. I spent too long on on this path to veer from it now. Do you recall the time we spoke of Wajana? She was the elder sister of Wabula, the Mikit, to whom you delivered those potions of blindness. Wahaja well, was in my is my one and only love. She was taken from me during the calamity. But I will see her live again. I will not rest until the day I can tell her the one thing she must know. 
I wonder what that is. I don't know. What is the one thing she must know? Did he never tell her? I don't know. Well, let's check out our new stuff. Alright, so there's our old one. Kind of silver grayish. And the new one is kind of gold. And it looks about the same. We'll update because it's better, of course. And that is it for today. So thanks for joining me. And we'll be back tomorrow for the last quest for now. Level 50. Until then, y'all take care.